What's going on everybody? My name is Turner. We are back with a brand new video. And I'm playing no. So we're back with a brand new video. And I'm really sorry that I'm wearing this shirt. <sighs> I just got off work like it's 11:38, so I just got off work and I just got this I have a pretty good idea of what it is I think it's light if it's not light it's a tripod and I believe I'm getting the tripod today yes I'm getting another tripod besides this one right here that you guys see uh, I'm getting a bigger one one that's like stands up like high as fuck honestly though I don't know which one it is because I got the um I think I got it from the same company. Limo Studio. I believe that is actually the lights. So, can't really tell because it has a tripod on it, but Limo Studio is, is the one I bought the lights from. I honestly can't really tell. <laughs> Let me turn on the light to see the lights, what the fuck. I really actually kind of hope it's the lights because I have horrible lighting in this room. Hard as fuck to find, like, see that's why I need the fucking tripod. <laughs> the exact reason why I need the tripod actually, is so that way I can stand it up. See if this will work. If it will, it's gonna be dope. When opening a box, it's best to not use a knife. Kind of hard to say, right? You don't want to use a knife because knives can kind of fuck up, and if it's too big, it can actually cut what's inside of the box. So what you want to use is a box knife. It's kind of you know, you know, you're like, well, you said don't use a knife, and so you're saying a box knife. Well, a box knife it has a really tiny razor, really thin, really sharp. So you want to make sure you're careful, don't touch the tip like I just did there. It's extremely sharp, which is why it's perfect for cutting boxes. And when the blade is done, you can just take it out, flip it over, I mean, flip it over, and then you can reuse the other side. Or you can just throw it away and get yourself an eraser. But it's best to use both sides. So kind of like a little tip there for you guys, if you guys ever order anything from uh, websites or anything like that. Found out it's the lights. It's the lights. You can actually see it. It's on there pretty damn good. That actually looks pretty dope. Like how it's like. Yeah, that's actually awesome. They're open, but it's awesome. Oh yeah. Each one. I'm gonna set them up too, actually. I'm set them up for you guys on the camera. Um, I wonder what this is. Probably the light bulb. Oh shit. A lot more little white boxes. That's for damn sure. And you guys see this in a lot of YouTubers' videos. I've honestly been waiting to get this until I had time for like. Alright, well, I have the money for it, but I'm not like. I've been waiting for it. Like, I have the money, but I have really nothing else to buy at the moment as far as like this much money. And I have enough money just to last me for the next couple weeks. I think I might be able to buy it just without having any problems financially. So, I bought them. I was waiting for that exact moment, and I just bought it, I believe, yesterday. I bought them yesterday. Amazon, for some reason, ships it to my house quick as fuck. But then again, they also just opened up an Amazon warehouse. Oh, yeah. If you guys don't know, this is the little umbrellas that you guys see. Yeah, this is the umbrella. You, like, set it like this, and then the camera points that way. This is a bag to carry everything. That's actually pretty handy. I like having the bags. So I have two of these, which is really all you need. One on the left side, one on the right side. That's for the umbrellas. I don't know what this is for. Oh, bag. Another bag. That's actually dope. It's Limo Studio. So if you guys want to go check them out, they're actually pretty damn good. Uh, there's the little tripod that it comes on. I believe that might be this box right here. Yep. Tripod one. And this is the tripod number two over there. So we'll go ahead and take out the first tripod. The third kind of tinier tripod, as you guys can tell. I can't really tell if you guys can see everything but so I'm not really like all this is my very first time ever seeing anything any equipment like this I've like seen it I guess because I've been like in like a spot where photography whether it's like me taking like me getting the picture mainly that's about it honestly uh, I've walked by it this is for the flashlight I'm pretty sure this goes down a full tripod and then this is where the tripod goes in at don't really know if you guys can really see that and on the back here it has a switch off on yeah pretty much I'm gonna make sure that's off whenever you put it in the light bulb or else it will turn on and this another one 
They just have the umbrella, they should be That's why. What the fuck? And now, this isn't really much of a waste of money. It's really not that expensive at all, honestly. I wonder if the light bulbs come sold separately. If so, I'm going to be a little bit irritated about that. What is this? Oh, sweet! The light bulb! <laughs> Except I only have one. I have like three, I believe. Oh, this is, might be the one for the tiny one, and then this might be the other two light bulbs. Here, I'm going to do it to where you guys can actually see it. Alright, so... There's that. We're going to take out umbrella number one. Alright, so, umbrella number one. And then, you just stick it in there. Alright, so, we have this part done. Not main. And then you just need the wire, and then that runs down. But I'm gonna set up the tripod first, the actual like, tripod. Oh, well, I guess I can, like. Nope, no fault. Ah. <laughs> Alright, there we go. That seems legit. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and set up this uh, studio light, and it's gonna be fucking dope. See you guys when that's all set up. Okay, so I have it set up, and honestly, it took like two fucking seconds. Here it is. I don't really know if you guys can see it, but. Damn. I think I might actually fucking like this. This is a banging ass light. It's actually fucking nice. Now, if I really wish it was possible for me to get the other one over here, it's gonna be very fucking hard in order to get that. It's a lot brighter in this room. Honestly, it's fucking crazy. Like, all right, so here it was before. Just a moment. This was the room before, then after. Now. I mean, it, it looks kind of blue because the other light was yellow, so it kind of captures, like, everything. But that made a ginormous difference. It's fucking ridiculous. I actually didn't even think it was going to make nearly a difference, but it's kind of crazy. So I'm going to go ahead and set the other one up right in that corner. You might think, like, oh, you don't have that much room. It's really not going to work out too well. And I think that actually might be right. I don't think it's really going to work out too well either. But there's enough room back there. It's... Kind of space, kind of spacious. There's some room back there, and if it comes down to it, I can always move the desk over and up. It won't be that big of a deal. I can do that. It won't won't take that much of a toll, all right? So it'll be fine. <laughs> so I can go ahead and do that. And actually, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now because this is fucking awesome. This is amazing. I'm really glad that I got these lights. They actually brighten up this room like crazy. Like it's fucking, it's really awesome how much they brighten up this room. I'm really glad that I got them. The whole equipment and stuff, it doesn't even cost that much. It may be costing me less than $100 for all this stuff. Honestly, it really did. So, alright, so the lights, they were 50 You can get those things cheap. So $50 for the lights. Those things are, that's crazy actually. I thought it would have been a lot more. The green screen. You can make a green screen for like $5. You can make one for $5, but the green screen I have was actually like maybe 10 But I also got it with um, the tripods and stuff that actually held the green screen. That was, I think, like 20 So that's $80 right there. So $80, and you can have yourself a really awesome setup for photography or video editing or whatever you would like to do honestly though that's that's fucking amazing so i'm actually gonna go ahead and set up this other one and if it works out um you guys will see i'm gonna go ahead and switch it over to that so i will see you guys whenever that's all set up and um if this is uploaded on friday i have a ton of videos for you guys um what i mean by that is i have like four videos i still need to edit and right now, today is Thursday, so I'm getting all this shit on Thursday. So, uh, I have a couple videos I still need to edit. I still need to edit my vacation video. That's going to take a very long time because I have about 40 clips, like, video clips. And I've never had that many. I've never had such an editing, like, such an edit. I've never had that amazing amount of edit. It's going to be crazy. And I have a lot of music to put in there, a lot of pictures to throw in there, too. I have about 40 to 50 pictures to throw in there. Um, I'm going to have to edit some pictures because they look a little bit bad um, so this, that video is gonna be crazy and it's gonna be coming out pretty soon I don't really know when and then I also have like a Call of Duty video I recorded right afterwards actually two of them it's a part one and a part two I will see you guys when I have all of this stuff set up even if I don't have it set up I'm still gonna see you guys here in just a second 
and kind of go through all the flaws and the perks of it. So, uh, kind of keep this spot in mind right here. There's nothing there, no lights or anything. I have about a good, oh, like half, six inches, seven inches of space. And I can always move it forward. I can always move it to the side. So, it's cool. And I can always have a green screen right here. In other words, I will see you guys here in just a moment. Here's what it looks like as the final product, and the tiny one is right there, but we have the big one over there, big one over here, which is actually fucking dope. It fits, uh, it kind of slants a little bit, but I'm not, I don't have OCD. I don't really mind much slanting. It won't really bother me. Um, wires aren't really all over the place, so I'm alright with, uh, as far as like the wires, that's the only thing that really gets me is wires, and I fucking hate it, I don't know why, I don't know. That's really the only biggest pet peeve that I have during videos is lighting, I just can't stand lighting, it gets on my fucking nerves. So it looks really weird inside of the camera, but if I were to make a video as a face cam, it legit, like it looks so great, it really does. I'm looking at it right now, and it really does look good. I actually might just like continue on the video on there, actually that's exactly what I'm gonna do. So, ha! First off, you guys can see how crazy my fucking hair is. Eww. Okay, so, I'm like I said, I'm really fucking excited just to kind of get this whole thing going. It looks fucking great in here. Like, it really fucking does. But now that I have the lights, it kind of makes everything a lot more clear. I can record in 1080p and make it look absolutely perfect. So, we are stepping up this channel, and it's fucking awesome. It's It really is fucking awesome. These lights look perfect, and they are perfect. They fit in the best spots. That is really about it for this video. This video has been going on for actually a little bit, surprisingly. I am actually going to go ahead and make, like, an updated room setup video. But I'm going to have to clean up this room because you guys really can't see it. But this room is a mess. It's fucking ridiculous. That is actually about it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please make sure to go ahead and drop a like. And as always, my name is Turner and I'm signing out. Deuces.